We present our work on FIDA, a model agnostic framework for features at any resolution. Much of computer vision research is focused on learning semantically meaningful features. These features often form the backbone of different dense prediction tasks, including image classification, semantic segmentation, and depth estimation. However, there's a trade-off. To learn these rich semantics, deep networks compress data from their original spatial dimensions by factors of 16, 32, or more. At such low resolutions, it's challenging to perform dense prediction tasks with these features alone. We propose FeedUp, a framework that upsamples any deep network's features to any resolution by combining the semantics from feature maps and the spatial detail from higher resolution inputs. FeedUp's goal is to recover all the lost spatial information in these features while retaining semantics learned by the vision backbones. This way, we can swap FeedUp features for existing ones and improve existing approaches without any retraining. To learn these upsampled features, we first generate views of the low resolution feature maps by perturbing an input with small pads, scales, and horizontal flips, and applying the model to each image. With the assumption that these low resolution views are formed by downsampling some latent high resolution features, FeedUp is designed to extract this underlying feature map. We parameterize the upsampler in two different ways. First, FeedUp can be parameterized as a joint bilateral upsampler where the high resolution input image guides the upsampling of our low resolution feature map. This JBU component is a feed forward module, making it fully trainable while plugged into an existing model. The upsampled features are then perturbed with the same transforms as before and filtered with a learned downsampler to evaluate a reconstruction loss against the original low resolution features. Alternatively, FeedUp's upsampler can be parametrized as an implicit network that produces the high resolution features at any resolution when queried. We also supply position and color encodings to allow the implicit network to better use high frequency information and converge more quickly. In addition to MSE, FeedUp is trained on a total variation smoothness prior on the feature magnitudes. By penalizing large differences in neighboring feature magnitudes, we reduce noise and create more cohesive feature maps. In addition to the choice of upsampler, we also introduce two different downsamplers. The first one consists of a learned blur kernel that is simple and trains quickly. However, it is not sensitive to nonlinear effects. For example, it cannot capture object salience. The more complex attention downsampler predicts a saliency map that is combined with spatially shared weights to produce a downsampling scheme that is more specific to the content of the features. For further discussion and ablations on these downsamplers, please refer to our paper. Here are some visualizations of vision transformer features upsampled by a factor of 16 through various methods. We can see that all methods preserve the low-frequency semantics present in the original features but only FeedUp incorporates high-frequency edges and fine details from the input image to produce more pixel-accurate features. We also observe boosts in quality for feature maps across a wide variety of backbones, and in the PCA breakdown, we see that FeedUp maintains feature resolution as objects are subdivided into more fine-grained parts. We also evaluate our methods on downstream tasks. Visualizing the class activation maps in the top row, we can qualitatively see that FeedUp produces salient regions accurate at the pixel level and that the cams are more cohesive and boundary focused. We also perform linear probe transfer learning to assess feature quality. We train a linear probe on the low resolution features and use it to evaluate semantic segmentation and depth estimation performance across multiple different upsampled features. Across both tasks, FeedUp produces higher resolution results and outperforms existing upsamplers. FeedUp's JBU variant can also directly substitute upsamplers in existing architectures such as the UNet. We train the SegFormer model end-to-end -end with FeedUp and show improvements over existing feature upsamplers. In summary, we propose a new feature upsampler that can be trained with a multi-view reconstruction framework. Parametrize this as a joint bilateral upsampler, FeedUp is a lightweight feed-forward module that can be dropped into any existing architecture and trained end-to-end. As an implicit network, FeedUp learns a per-image representation that can be queried at any resolution at inference time. Thank you, and for more details and results, please check out our website and paper.